lot of people ask me about Jimmy Hoffa. Jimmy Hoffa became aware of me and my ability to do things when there were problems in different cities or different unions. I would fix that problem. Not like fixers do, but like carpenters do. They go take care of it, the situation. And that's why him and I became a, He paid me well, too. Took care of me. So when he had all the problems and when he had, he went to jail and he did this and that. Then when he come home, I was happy for him. He had a huge pension and everything. He was okay. Then he started the rumble. He wanted to take back the Teamster. Like everybody, Teamster, the Teamster's local. The international. And everybody in the country heard about it. He was going from internet from local to local. And he finally came into the state of New Jersey. He said, Ralph, you know I'm running for the, the, the top spot. I'm taking that Fitzsimmons out of there. I'm throwing him the fuck out of there. And I came here to ask you, if I have any problems in Jersey here, I need your help. I looked at him, I hesitated a minute, I said, Jimmy, you know I love you. He said, I do. But, as you know, there's a saying, you can't serve two masters. You know I, who I belong to, don't you? He said, of course I do. I said, uh, now, if he tells me I can do it and washes his hands of the situation, I will help you. But if he says, got nothing to do with that, you stay the way you are. I have to stay. I wish I could help you, but if I can't, I'm going to send word that I can't. As you know, he looked at me for a while. He looked sad, then he said, I understand that, Rafi. I said, I was with them since I was a little boy. So you have to understand that. He said, I understand, and I appreciate you being so honest with me. I'm going to miss you. I said, Jimmy, is it, why are you, do you really need this? And I, then I, I asked the question, but I knew the answer. Jimmy, if he was a gambler, if he was a womanizer, if he was a drinker, he would have something else. He had nothing else in life but that international union, the Teamsters. That's the, what kind of great man he was. But he made a bad mistake there. And I looked at him. I could smell the dampness of the dirt of the grave when I looked at him. I hated that. I had them freaky things that I could feel. We shook hands, he hugged me, and I said, stay well, will you, Jim? And I never saw Jimmy Hoffa again. He got killed. It's a shame. It's a shame. He did it to himself, but it's a shame. 